Hello guys, and welcome to a tutorial on how you can get Voice Forge voices like David and other voices back on Rapper Offline. This method will work on both version 1.3 and version 2.0 of Rapper Offline. So, let's get into it. As you may know, Voice Forge updated their API to prioritize their new Android app, but there's a way to install this app on a computer which I'm gonna show you. First, open your web browser, then type bluestacks.com. After that, click See All Versions, next to download Bluestacks 5. Scroll down until you see two versions called Bluestacks 5 and Bluestacks 4. Click the download for Bluestacks 5, but if you have an older or slower computer like me, Download Bluestacks 4 since it's a bit faster than Bluestacks 5. Once it's finished, click Install Now, and it'll automatically download the files required to install Bluestacks, and then it'll install it. Once it's finished installing, Bluestacks will open the Google Play Store to sign in with your Google account. The first app you need to install is called Personal DNS Filter. This will act as an ad blocker to let you use VoiceForge without ad interruptions. Once it's finished installing, start the app. It'll automatically turn on the filter to block ads. Keep in mind, whenever you restart Bluestacks, always turn on the filter before you start using VoiceForge. Then, download and install VoiceForge. After it's done installing, open VoiceForge and it'll tell you to sign in. Sign in with your Google account. Then, scroll down to the voice you want and test it. On the first generation, you'll have to click the play button twice since it'll cut off part of the first word. Hello world. Hello world. Hello world! After that, you'll need Audacity in order to record your lines. Open your web browser again and type Audacity download. Then, click the first link then download for Windows. It'll automatically download it for you. Follow the on-screen instructions to install Audacity.
Once Audacity is open, click Audio Setup, then change the host to Windows Wasapi and change the recording device to headphones or speakers, depending on what's plugged into your computer. Then finally, click Record and press Play on VoiceForge to record your lines. Hello world. Export the voices in MP3 file, then import it as a voiceover and wrapper offline, and you're done. And that'll be it for this tutorial on how to get VoiceForge working on wrapper offline using BlueStacks and Audacity. I hope this tutorial will help you use these voices again.